Welcome to the Zenith. It's been around for over two decades, and Rob and his partner Elaine got involved about 17 years ago. I kind of describe this store as an installation. It's kind of organic, it just grows. First off, there's the antique store. This is our religious wall. Any longtime Pittsburgh person's gonna remember a lot of this stuff from their parents' homes. We do a lot of vintage clothing. I do uh, love our tie selections. There's the shrine to Pittsburgh sports. Uh, we did it as a kind of joke, and people started bringing more and more stuff to it. It's an art gallery. That's a, a, a new work in progress with the cherubs. It's a place for Rob to show off his unique sculptural pieces. This is my chandelier lamp. It's made of four different chandeliers. I made a people mobile out of vintage meat hooks. And of course, it's a vegetarian and vegan restaurant, which serves up a popular buffet brunch every weekend. We start from scratch every week. It's about what I find in the strip. Then we build the menu on that. Whenever you have brunch, it's 11.50. It includes an entree, coffee and tea, and the buffet. About 15 different salads we have on it. But there's certain salads that if we don't have, they'll be like attacks and rebellions. And then we make all our cakes from scratch as well. Everything is made vegan. And everything, really everything, is for sale here. Yeah, we'll even sell your table that you sit at. But that's not all. Oh, the bathroom. You have to see the bathroom. Everybody talks about this. This is another weird thing. We started off as a joke with the owls. People started bringing us more and more owls. And a lot of people say when they come in here, uh, they feel uncomfortable because there's too many eyes looking at them. I kind of like them. And here's a tip. When you get your bill at the end of brunch, Read it closely to find out what your table's nickname is. The scary lady table is over that big portrait of the lady. That is the real Zenith cat. <laughs> Maurice! He's being grumpy. You never know what you'll find when you visit the Zenith. But if you're lucky, you might just leave with a stomach full of bunt cake and a glass jar full of doll heads. I'm sure I'll eventually do something with it.